Um, and especially nobody will give you the JPEG adapter together with the phone. But that's what we are doing. So um, I call this actually, at one funny night at, at, at FIC, I called it uh, JTAG to the people. Um, so um, what, what, like, when you want to do the low, low level development on any kind of hardware, you need JPEG access to, um, to be able to, to do low, like hardware debugging. To, to, uh, if you have an empty unit or a broken unit, you can use JPEG to reflash it from, from the beginning. Um, in the system level development. And uh, we also have to back with the serial console on the system. Um, and in order to have the access without even doing any soldering or doing any, any kind of uh, hardware development, um, what uh, OpenMoco has is this uh, debug board. Okay. This is the PCB, and you can connect this PCB using a, a, what's called FPC, a flexible printed circuit, a flat table with the phone, and then this is a USB port, and you attach it to your PC, and then you can um, access the data port of the device, and the serial control of the device, um, without any other equipment. You know, Everything is built in. So the USB serial adapter is built in, the USB JTAG adapter is built in, everything is in the board, and uh, um, uh, the uh, uh, chipset, um, uh, the developer model, uh, what we call the advanced uh, advanced. So as I said, we want the, the device to be accessible and hackable at any possible level. Um, we, so there is some, some edge or some, some line which we cannot pass. So um, for anyone who's ever dealt with uh, the, the GFM industry, um, you will know that the NDAs and, and whatever exists on the GFM side are extremely restrictive and extremely uh, um, uh, tough, uh, even if you compare it with NDAs in other parts of the industry. So what we did to, to, to solve this problem is we, we chose a GSM mo modem, um, which is completely self-contained, and a serial board, and a serial board attaches to the Linux system, and um, all the communication happens in the serial channel. And the protocol on the serial channel is um, standardized in, in what's called the ETSI GSM specification. And the standards are freely available for anyone. Anyone can download it from the, the uh, ETSI website. And uh, so all the commands and the protocol is, is, is also But the inside of what's happening in the GSM modem is completely um, like it's a black box. Um,